How you doing, Tulumi? I'm doing fine. <laughs> very, very good. We're going to get right into this um, interview. I saw this young lady online. I just happened to see one of her promos that um, I think it's her management company sent out. And I just started listening to her music, and I liked the videos and music, everything. And I was like, wow, this would be a really good guest to be on our show. So we just thank you for coming out oh, and being a part of you. this. Thanks for inviting me. So, um, Tulumi, tell us where you're from and how you began your singing career. Well, I'm a Nigerian and Canadian, and uh, I really started singing um, as a youth in uh, church and also in my high school, well, grade school and also high school. Um, and in church, it was just with the choir. In school, it was with the uh, cultural group, dance troupe. So I sang and danced Great. a lot in high school. That was a good time. And I did also continue doing that in Toronto when I moved there to go to college. And I joined the all new reggae band and um, started off as backups, doing backups, and I grew from there. Learned a little bit of the Patois language. <laughs> but um, I think from there on, I just, I've just just been growing. And uh, for me, as I decided to take this on as a second career. Tulumi, um, how did you decide on that name for yourself, Tulumi Day, T-O-L-U-M-I-D-E? Well, it's really a fusion of my first and my last name. My first name is, uh, well, the full first name is Tolulope. Say the full first name again? Tolulope. Okay. It's actually a shortened version of a whole sentence that says, Tolulope. Uh, and that means to God be glory, to God be praised. And then my last name means, and my last name is Olumide, which in full sentence is Olumide which is God has come and it's a name that my great 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 grandfather adopted when they accepted Christianity into their family. So that's how, uh, so for me I just used my, you know, since there was Olu in both my first name and my last name, and Olu really is God, I decided to just, you know, create Olu with him from that. That's well, we appreciate that you created that name from there because otherwise we wouldn't have been able to pronounce your name. Oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the kind of tough, you know, the way, yeah. So yeah, that's great. But tell us about the CD here. Which which one would you like to sing for us right now? Well, I can start off with my uh, main track, My Love. And uh, My Love is, you know, is actually the title of the CD itself mm -hmm. as well. And um, pretty much it's my own description of um, my relationship and my recognition really of God, God Almighty. Mm -hmm.
gonna be in London, England. Yeah, yeah. 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 you gonna be an international music. Yeah, be an international star. And I tell you, every time you see, um, I've sang in a lot of African churches before. Mm -hmm. And they have so much energy. If you were over here in the studio with us, you'll see she's just rocking in the road. Oh, yes. <laughs> I mean, they, they really move. They don't just stand still. Oh, yes. right. They use their whole, they glorify God with their whole body. Yes. You know. So what's the name of your community that you're from? Well, I'm, well, my, I'm Nigerian, but I'm, uh, my tribe itself is um, Yoruba. Can you say that again? That word? The Yoruba tribe. So it's Y O R U B A. Okay. Yoruba. Yoruba. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And, like um, Aruba. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, like a, yeah. Mm -hmm. The music was done by uh, Terry Point Dexter, and he's uh, he's in Memphis, Tennessee. So you did that song in Memphis, Tennessee. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I went to wow. Memphis and I did so what about the rest of the songs on here? Who wrote and produced those? Um. Well, I wrote pretty much. Um, well, them and I think except um, two of them were co-written. Okay. Okay. Um, and, yeah, two of them. And, and the same producer, producer as far as music. Different producers. Okay. Yeah, so they're different, different producers, and then uh, I guess the main person, uh, Terry, did three of my songs. So he did My Love, and he also did What I'd Like to Be, mm -hmm. and he also did um, uh, More Than We Never Knew. Okay. It's like a kind of really a love song. Okay. And then the, then um, really, the, uh, I have two other um, producers I work with, Mark Baker and Eric Dennis. They did it, about three other songs. Mm -hmm. Another producer did about two songs. So I really work with a, a different range of people. Some of okay. them are just you know, musicians, uh -huh. just women, and just live life. composition of what I like to be. Yeah, I want to be more like Jesus. How about you guys? Yes. Yes. You know, we want to be more and so more like the Father, love. you know? Yes. So, so love. Lumi J, you are there, girl. You are yes. there. You're so yes. full yes. of yes. love. You're so full of life. Yes. Yes. You know, just having you on the show is really a blessing us. Isn't it, everyone? Yes. Yes. I'm telling you. Yes. I'm telling you. Yes. We appreciate you, girl. Yes. Oh. Amen. And again, Ms. Tanumi Day's album's release is coming up Sunday, May the 30th. If you like what you heard. When you finish the project, you just feel, you know, there's just a sense of comfort and fulfillment that you've been done, you know, that you've this done project is done. And you what know, was in you to do. Exactly. Right, because if God put in your heart to do what you're going to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. utilizing those times. Okay. Oh, so congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah, congratulations. When did you get married? I got married in uh, April last year. Last uh, year? Yeah. Wow. Yep, not so much. Newlywed. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so what does your husband think about what you're doing? Oh, he's very supportive. He manages me, yeah. He's very supportive. Oh, he's your manager? Uh-huh, yeah. He's oh, manager. Keep the money in the family. Yes. Keep the money in the family. Okay, so